Well, the open house is, is to commemorate the opening of our Modesto facility at Valley Caps. We're a day program for developmentally disabled adults. They come to our program five days a week and we provide over 500,000 hours of uh, care and service to this population every year. And it was just a way to invite the parents in, invite others in, elected officials in, to see the work that we do here and, and to, to, to kind of get a feel for what Valley Caps is all about. You know, just because they're developmentally disabled, they're adults, they have the same wishes and desires and hopes that everyone does. They want to be happy, they want to be productive, they want to be members of their society, they want to be able to volunteer. So we try to create a total environment for them. Uh, inside we do have a computer lab, we have about 15 computers and they surf the web just like anyone else would. They have interests, sports, books, movies, YouTube, Facebook, um, they, they enjoy it all. Out into the community they do a lot of volunteering, they help uh, feed those less fortunate that are at risk of going hungry, they like to go out and go bowling, they like to go shopping, who doesn't? Um, they just need a little bit of help to achieve those independent goals that they desire and that's what we're here to do. My name's Carol Bonet and I'm serving on the board of directors for Valley Caps and I just want to say that my brother Gerald Wright was one of their first consumers back in the early 1970s and he learned to live independently here and had his own apartment and really thrived. I can't say enough for the staff here and what they do for the developmentally disabled population. I'm so proud that they've grown so big that now they're ster serving Stanislaus County. I think it's a wonderful tribute to our population with these special needs and I'm so glad to be a part of it. Well, we're here from myself, I'm John Freeman, this is Bob Busser, we're from Assemblyman Bill Berryhill's office and uh, we just want to let you know that the Assemblyman is very grateful as are we for the services you provide to the people in the community, it's very important and uh, we'll let you know we have a certificate of recognition for you here. And in appreciation for the care and concern you show the members of your community who rely so much on your services, compassion, and expertise. Congratulations and thank you for expanding your services in our community. I, my name is Pat O'Brien and I'm with Assemblyman Tom Berryhill's office, 25th District, and I am so honored to be here. Oh, well, thank you. Um, the work that you do for this community, is it, it goes beyond words. Oh, most kind. Thank you. Um, I know you have a heart for this kind of work. I have a heart for this, yes. Um, not just myself, but a l so many people in this community that some of the advantages that um, I might not have been able to receive 30 some years ago, <laughs> um, they have it today. And God bless you and thank you so much for your work. And I'd like to read with the assembly. We have a certificate of recognition also for you. I'd like to read it. Your commitment to uphold the principles and professional integrity of those who advocate for the developmental challenge in our community will distinguish this facility for years to come. Your dedication to the residents of Stanislaus County is greatly appreciated. I am honored to commemorate and celebrate this momentous occasion. I'm Corey Hawkins from Congressman Dennis Cardoza's office, and I'm very happy to be here today, um, personally to see uh, your facility and learn more about your program. I'm happy to be here on this very special day and I would like to present you with this certificate from the Congressman from the U.S. House of Representatives, and I'll go ahead and read it. It says, it is with the greatest pleasure that I take this opportunity to congratulate you on your open house. Our community undoubtedly benefits from the services you provide. Please accept my best wishes and sincerest gratitude. It is a pleasure to serve as your representative in the United States Congress. Sincerely, Dennis Cardoza. Valley Caps has, has been around for 34 years now, and this is our first facility in Modesto. We have other facilities up in San Joaquin County. And if you're out and about and you want to come by and see us, we're on Blue Gum Road, 1900 Blue Gum. Come on in, take a tour, see the good work that's being done.